We're here at Barber about to do a track day on the V4R and look who I ran into, Kyle Wyman. What's up, buddy? How you doing? I'm good, man. And look at his V4R, full race spec. Kyle, take us through real quick about your bike here. Tell us a little bit oh, about it. Oh, man. I mean, there's not a whole lot that's stock left yeah. on this thing. You know, all the, the fuel tank's completely custom. Yeah. All full carbon fiber race body work, evil technology, triple clamps, oversized super bike forks. We got the electronics kit from Ducati Corsa. Nice. And there's uh, not a whole lot left untouched. Yeah, man. STM clutch, SC project, custom exhaust, Brembo, core motor lines. Wow. OZ wheels. This thing is gorgeous. And you still got the wings, too. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Those things are so effective. Yeah. Well, awesome, man. Good luck to you for the rest of the racing season, man. Thank you. We got Ryan here from Ducati. You want to say a couple things? Trevor get started, I just want to thank everybody for coming out. Uh, this is the second annual event we've done at Barber, so thanks again for coming out. Okay, so we're gonna ride here at Barber Motorsport Park on the V4R with my good buddies here from the Ducati Desmo Group. Special thanks to my good buddy DJ from Mountain Motorsports, the Roswell location, for having me out here today. He's a really cool dude. I'll be doing more meetups with him at his dealership real soon. Let's fire this puppy up, huh? We're off. So as you can see, I'm behind a 2020 S1000 RR. I met this guy earlier today. He has the Brentune ECU flash. And I'm gonna try to hang out with him here at the track. Do somewhat of a comparison video. He also has the Krapovich MotoGP shorty exhaust on the bike. And behind me is my good buddy Guy on his Ducati the V4S Corsa. We're approaching my least favorite part of the track, Charlotte's Web. This is where I crashed my Yamaha R3. So I always like to take it easy out here in the first couple of laps. Let's see that Brent Tune power! Too soon, too soon for me to take him down. I could have done it right then. Whoa. I slid a little bit. Now I gotta catch him.
But this makes it exciting trying to catch him. My sights. Charlotte's Web again. Got another rider I gotta watch out for. Couple riders ahead of me. Still stalking the Bryn 2 and S1000. My tires, unfortunately, are on their last leg. I have a set of tires in the trailer, but. I gotta get this guy. So the good news is that these tires are warming up good. Now it's time for me to shift it into high gear for me. You guys might think that this is still low gear. For me it's high gear. Try to get this guy, but without taking out these other riders. This is the intermediate group, by the way. And I'm just practicing for a showdown with my good buddy Steve, five up. Oh, Mr. Ventini. Couldn't get him there. But hopefully some other bikes will get ahead of him. He's wearing all black. The perpetrator's wearing all black. Between 25 and 30, white male Caucasian tobacco smoker, adulterer, and I'm going to take him downtown for processing. At some point, I hate Charlotte's Web. Fucking hate it. tuning back in my sights position one put the put the chicken in the rooster put the chicken in the oven I should say preheating oven cook it Chicken is cooked. Brin tuning S1000 taken down. Mission accomplished. Fly home safely. Afterburners engaged. Now, I want that female with her pretty little ponytail dangling. And Heavy D right in front of me. I'd like to take him out too. These tires, these uh, Diablo Super Corsa V3s performing nicely. Targeting Heavy D. Ponytail female is out of the picture. Can only target one individual at a time. Oh, that 
was a gutsy move, but that is a track marshal. So he's good. Heavy D on a Terrigale, take him down. Let's see if uh, Heavy D is gonna put up a fight. Gap sauce, gap sauce. Heavy D is on a Terrigale. Uh, final edition, I can tell by the exhaust. 1299, and that bike just does not have the stones to challenge the people are on the track or filthy maggot infested streets. This is actually my favorite part of the track. Oh, look at that guy. That's a fucker that needs to be in advance. Why he's out here effing around with us and intermediates beyond me. He needs to go face some real competition in advance. I've had enough fun. It's freaking a hundred and some odd degrees today. I accomplished the missions I set out, took down the Brintuned S1000 double R on the track. And another rider or two. And that's it. Now I can go drink an Izzy flavored water <laughs> and just relax. And now their outstanding track day here at Barber Motorsport Park is in the books. Nobody had an agricultural experience as far as I'm aware. And it was an outstanding but hot day here near Birmingham, Alabama. What a fantastic track. Got to see a lot of my good buddies like Kyle Wyman, Red Spade, and all the awesome people from the Alabama Desmo Ducati Owners Group. These guys are super, super cool people. Also got to meet a lot of my awesome subscribers that were here as well. So a special shout out to everybody that I saw and entertained today. You guys were amazing. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. If you're already a subscriber, tap that bell and you'll get notified when new content is uploaded. Everybody's packing up and putting their precious Ducatis back into their trailers. This one's amazing. Ducati V4 with a lot of extra parts. Ah, sounds great. So thanks so much for viewing this video. Stay tuned for more amazing track day videos from here at Barber Motorsport Park and everywhere else that I happen to visit. You guys are amazing. Thanks for viewing, and I hope to see you at a track day coming soon. Have a great one, guys.